And hello everyone, I'm back playing Zero Escape at Zero Time Dilemma, and we are actually very close to the end of the game, but first, we have to complete this next chapter. Not sure what it is, but let's go. Apocalypse. He kind of like smashes Professor X around and went like, oh, it's so just like that. Carlos isn't coming. Wait, what? What is he doing? He, he promised he'd come. Uh, maybe he's. Don't say it. I'm going to go check in the lounge. Hey, Junpei. This... this is Ward D? No shit. What the hell is... Oh... What happened? It's kind of like oh, when we flew a I better get a Connie. ...and everything. Yeah. That happened. My guess is that something exploded. Exploded? A bomb went off in the decontamination room. Who'd do that? Unauthorized escape. Do you get it? D-Team set the bomb. Oh. And that's how the ceiling collapsed in that room. But why is it now completely buried in sand? Hmm. Oh, the ceiling probably gave in a little while after they escaped. Oh, Jesus. The history where I'm alive and you are dead. Oh, zero. You found your way here safely. So tell me the important thing. Zero. As promised, the important information. First, Akane. A history you find yourself in is that one. What? No! Dun dun dun. The first Radical Six patients have left. They should reach the hospital shortly. The pandemic is unavoidable now. The virus is spreading all over the world. That's a damn lie. It has to be! No, it is the truth. Free the Soul's plan is progressing smoothly. Then that's gotta mean you're that cult's... Correct. I am the founder of Free the Soul. Many call me Brother. You bastard! Thanks to your shitty dream, six billion people will... Don't be mistaken. If we do nothing now and let time pass, an even worse future awaits. A religious fanatic will trigger a nuclear war with a terrorist attack. Eight billion. All of mankind will perish. Unfortunately, the fanatic's identity is unknown. Therefore, I decided to kill six billion people. Why? By doing so, I will have a 75% chance that they are among the virus's casualties. To tell the truth, history has proven me right. So, to kill one person, you'll sacrifice six billion? It is to save two billion people. And that's how you use Radical Six. 
You don't believe that's the ethical choice? What? Uh, of course I don't! Is that all you think human lives are worth? Do you feel nothing as you kill off a whole bunch of innocent people? But that's just the way of life. Life Sinner is unfair. Or insect, people will die or be killed in an unjust manner. Like your parents, Akane Kurashiki. Wh what are you talking about? Your father was sentenced to death for a crime he didn't commit. In grief, your mother killed herself. No, that's wrong! My parents were involved in an accident! You were likely told that, but it is a lie. What I shared just now is the truth. Genuine shock. No! Think about it. If your father hadn't been falsely accused, how different your life would have been. You'd never have been involved in that child abduction case ten years ago. And clearly, the incident a year ago would not have happened either. And of course, Junpei. The path you've walked during your life would have been completely different, too. The smallest things have a drastic effect on a person's life. If everybody was under this As building. I said, that's just the way it is. But that doesn't mean that you have free reign to just mess with the lives of people like that! Only God decides who lives and who dies! <laughs> To think you, of all people, would invoke God. Very well. I will let you see the true God that we believe in. You, of course, see the clothing laying on the bar counter. The evening of April 12, 2029. Wear those and take part in our ceremony. There. I shall tell you the secrets of the world. There's no way I'd ever go! No. You will most definitely come. Well, that is, if you manage to escape the shelter. Just watch. I'll get out soon. Of course we will. Diana's bringing back a rescue team. No, she's not. Do they even have any reason to believe that the two of you are alive? If there is no rescue, then the remainder of your lives will carry out at this sacred site. Sacred site? This is the sacred site where the birth of brother, founder of Free the Soul, occurred. Are you saying... You were born here? Yes, but raised elsewhere. What? The moment we were born, we were transferred to the past via the transporter. Back to April 1904. Huh? 1904? Wait, did you just say we? Yes. Do you mean your little brother? It's true, I had a younger brother, but we were not related by blood. He was the son of the couple who raised me. Then... Let me clarify. My we is referring to my younger sister. You know this person very well. Zero... Is Delta? Ah, it appears I've spoken too long. Brother but Defee? I will impart to you something very important. The spell to open Pandora's box. We were Odier. Remember these words well. It will come in handy someday. We were Odier? It's Latin. Live for today.
Oh my. Oh, I wonder what's happened to Carlos. Maybe he won't be coming. Uh, why would you say that? Maybe... Maybe nobody's going to come to save us. Like Zero said, Diana and the others probably don't know we're alive in here. It'll just be us two, in this place, forever. No... I think there's someone else. Or maybe more like something. Oh, God, yeah. you make everything better. Oh, I'm glad you're safe. Hey, look, isn't there something in his collar? This is. Anagram? Oh, yeah, um, that's when you rearrange the letters of a word or phrase. But we need to know the sentence to work from. The original sentence, huh. Oh, hey, uh, Akane, do you remember the Ward C Lounge? E yes. What did it say on the wall? It was let the game end where I treat two. Can we make any other phrases using all the letters from that? Um, uh... well, it's not perfect, but. Together with me, we are ten. But if that's what it is, there are leftover letters. How many? Five extra letters. L, D, A, E, T. The thing is, I don't know what word I could make out of them. But what could together with me, we are ten, mean? It could be saying, if you're with me, then there are ten of us. Ten? I mean, there are plenty of other ways to read. Where are you going, Junpei? Hey, why isn't Q on this board? Why? Well, because he's not dead. Wait, he... he's still alive? I think so. Huh. Q is alive. We are ten. What? No. A firefighter? Sorry about the wait. Well, I guess I was the one who waited. <laughs> I promised, didn't I? <laughs> Carlos. I'll come back for you. Wait, are you... Hey, Junpei, Akane, I'm here to save you. Okay, just wow, okay. 
you if you haven't figured this out major spoilers just now Sigma got freaky with Diana gave birth to two kids one named Fee and one named Sigma uh D Delta Delta Fee is the Fee in the game okay she just multiple timelined and everything and lived in the future also with Sigma and all that he doesn't even know that Fee is his daughter and then Delta Delta is zero that's his name Delta is zero Delta is also Fee's brother and then his biological brother well, not, oh, not biological brother. His brother from the scientist marriage is the first zero of sorts from... I, I, I'm not really sure on that aspect because I haven't played the other titles. But this zero is Delta. So if Diana and Sigma did not get freaky in any timeline, zero wouldn't exist. And zero is killing six billion people to save two billion people from a man who will eliminate all eight billion people. Huh. And now, we can complete the game, finish the endings, finish all this stuff now, because now we have the important phrases of the anagrams to use on the lovely little boxes, so we can all escape. Oh, dear lord, though. That is... ridiculous. So there is a potential way to save everybody still from Radical Six. Oh, dear lord, wow. And I remember, I haven't played any of the previous titles. This is like the first game for me, and I am just mind-fucked right now. Although, I totally see what Carlos did. That was pretty cunning of him. He traveled into the past from the one we saw earlier where he said he has to save us in a different timeline. So what he did is he used... Oh, he died. And used the transfer machine again to send his consciousness through to an entirely different universe. Uh, and then what he did is he sent his consciousness early so he was not at decom and none of this actually happened and because of that he was able to come back even after being dead and rescue everybody who was stuck there so by the end of that Q is alive Ah, uh, yeah Q is alive Mira is dead oh thank god Eric is dead yes Ah. Uh, Sigma and Diana and Fee are alive, but Fee is infected with Radical Six, and she will most likely die from that, actually, I think, because she is just uh, infected with it. And... Yeah, so pretty much everybody is alive for the future setting that the other games basically uh, take from. So that, that is the primary story. That is where everything is set up in terms. However, now we have to do the other ending. Like it's, it's potential ending where Radical Six never escapes into the world, I think. And because of that, 8 billion people will most likely die in the future. So... Holy shit! Oh, wow. Mindfuck right there. Oh, my lord. Oh, wow. Cheers. Thanks for watching. Damn. Oh, I'm gonna be gab. So, let me get this straight. You... you shifted to the history where you pushed the yellow button. I can't... 
leave with you guys. Huh? I made a promise in another history that I'd definitely save you two. Then you went back in time ten months by activating the unused transporter? So you guys would be able to transport to this history. I needed ten months to charge the device again after I used it. And then you just... waited? For a long time. That's right. You didn't think of stopping Zero's plan? If I did that, then I couldn't have met you guys, right? That was one hell of a thing you did. Huh? Do you know what happened because of you? Mira and Eric died. Sigma lost his arms and an eye, and he's in the hospital! That's not all. Zero said... The first Radical Six patients... have left. It's... it's too late. We can't stop the spread of the virus. What happened today... is going to result in six billion people. This is the end. I have to start over from the beginning. Start over? We'll start now and spend the next 45 years preparing for my plan. Y you have a plan? In 45 years, I'm going to call Sigma and Phi's consciousnesses to the future. We must do it, or we can't save all those people. I'll help you, Akane. Let me join Crash Keys, or, or whatever you're calling it. I can't do that. Why? I'm going to need you to forget everything you know, Junpei. Wait, what? I'm really sorry. Ah! Hey, hey, Akane! No, you, you... you can't be... Why? Junpei, I will never forget you. But please, forget me. You need to forget. No, I don't want to. I'll never forget. No matter what happens. I won't. I... I won't. Akane! Why? I do what I must to accomplish my goals. That is just how I am. Even if that means I must lose my life, I... I swear I'll make the AB project a success. Fly me to the moon and let me sing among the stars. I don't care if you come from Jupiter or Mars. There, you get that little bonus for watching.